just realised he looks like a smug, white Kermit the Frog. He has frog lips. Right, this is Nigel versus Twitter. Uh, I know uh, this is the one media where people can be really beastly. I've not pre-seen any of these. Let's give it a go. Mark Rudden says, He's probably the only person in the world who loves the sound of his own voice more than Piers Morgan does. That's quite a contest, isn't it, really? A man who's never been elected as an MP thinks he's running the country. Suppose that could be either of them. Well, um, Mark, all I can say is that I have been an MEP for 20 years. Uh, I have campaigned up and down the length and breadth of this country. Uh, whether you like me or hate me, uh, I think you could at least credit me. I have shifted quite a lot of minds on this question of Europe. A rambling man says, your milkshake brings all the fascists to the yard or something. We'll move on. Evie says, Jesus suffering. Can someone inform me as to why and how Nigel Farage has managed to gain a majority in this election? I'm completely done with this country. Goodbye. Uh, Dave the Happy Singer says, this dog looks like Nigel Farage, right? Okay. Um, I was actually compared to a meerkat, not a dog, but never mind. And shout out to big Nigel Farage, doing what he does best to the establishment. What a beacon of hope we have in him and his handsome face and sharp suit and his modern views. Good Lord, well, there you are. Some people like me. Let's try Rob Goats. You're doing great work, Mr. Farage. I'll buy you a pint if ever I see you up your local. I'll be there in about an hour's time. Uh, Chris Wade Evans says, Nigel Farage is the most dangerous man in Britain. In fact, what he's doing here, he's retweeting an article that appeared in the New York Times yesterday. So I had a lot of friends in America uh, texting me to say, this is what some parts of America think of you. I've got to tell you, I'm rather pleased about that. Dan says, I still haven't got my mother a Christmas present. Did Nigel Farage release a sexy calendar this year? No! But my mum's done several and done them for charity and raised over £50,000 for the local hospice. Not bad, eh? George Fairburn says, Just realised he looks like a smug, white Kermit the Frog. He has frog lips. Takes all sorts, you know. Justin says, I can confidently predict that Nigel Farage will um, go away at the instant he is faced with any expectation of responsibility. Well, I tell you what, Justin, I want us in the Brexit party to be part of the government team to get us ready for leaving on the 31st of October with no deal. I want responsibility. You're wrong. Annalisia says, Nigel Farage, I could seriously marry you. Well, I don't know. I wouldn't recommend it. Several have tried. It never seems to work very well. Izzy says, don't want nudes unless you're... Oh, no, thank you. We'll move on. Uh, Mike Harris says, if you like him or hate him, this is a guy who has used democracy to bring change. Wish more countries would learn that you don't have to use force. It's a big point, uh, actually, Mike, you know, that democracy is uh, what keeps the country peaceful. The trouble is, you've got to respect democratic votes. The loser has to consent to what's just happened. And since the referendum, there's been a bit of a problem with that. And that's it. We're done. Thank you, everybody, um, for your mostly good contributions. Nigel Farage, I could seriously marry you. Well, I don't know, I wouldn't recommend it. Several have tried, it never seems to work very well.